Lord of the Sign of Scorpio, hello, welcome to my channel. Just remember the top cards that you see, they're paired with the bottom cards. And the decks that I use for this reading, I will have them listed in the description box below. I've already shuffled and will be taking a look at the recent past energy between you and the person that you're currently dealing with. We'll see what's coming up for the two of you. We'll find out what the challenge is going to be. And then we'll take a look and see what the outcome is. So Scorpio, the recent past energy between you and your person. Well, we got the High Priestess and it's with the Knight of Pentacles. So what this is telling me is that for some of you Scorpios, you were dealing with someone that, um, well, there was a lot of attraction in the connection. They could have been really attracted to you, and you could have been really attracted to them with the high priestess here. Yeah. But things were moving slow, or they started to move slow for some reason. But there was a lot of attraction. Yeah, maybe for some of you, your person was too slow for you. Or you could have decided to put a halt or just slow things down for some reason. But let's take a look and see what's coming up for the two of you. So we got this strength card, and it's with the Nine of Wands. Well... The Nine of Wands is a card that's below the word present. What this is telling me is that you could start to feel stressed out about this person or the connection. And it's showing that you could start to build a wall and not let this person in. With the Strength card here, it's telling me that you could feel like it's not a supportive or strong connection. Yeah. And for a lot of you, that's what you need from this person. So you, it's looking like you could start to close yourself off to this. Nine of Wands builds a wall. And no one gets past the barricade. So... Let's move on over. Let's take a look and see what the challenge is. We got the Five of Swords. And it's with, the it's with the Devil card. So, yeah, your person, they feel that you're closing yourself off to this. Um, it's showing that they could be mad. Five of Swords brings conflict. Or there could be conflict or or... Um, your person just being angry. Yeah, I don't know if you just you just automatically shut this person out, and they start to feel some kind of way because five of swords can be about mixed feelings. Um, but you feel like this person could have addictions, or they do have addictions with the devil card here. Someone could have. Um, a strong, a strong hold on this person, or something could have a strong hold on on them. That's what you could be feeling, and this could be the reason why things started to slow down, or why you felt like they were moving too slow. Something has a hold on this person. Could be addictions, or it could be someone or a situation. But they're starting to feel some kind of way that you, you're you closing yourself off to this. You just don't feel like it's strong enough. So this person could be mad. Now some addictions could be... Addictions could be like greed, envy, materialism, obsession. It could be sexual lust. Or it could just be some toxic behavior, some devil type of energy. 
Or, like I said, someone or something could have a hold on this person. But they, they really don't like that you, you're building a wall. If, or they feel like you're doing this. Yeah, you just don't think the connection is mutually supportive. But let's move on over. Let's see what the outcome is. We have the Six of Pentacles and so with the Page of Pentacles. Yeah, so the Six of Pentacles, the card above the word outcome. They feel like you're not giving to this anymore. Yeah, they, the Six of Pentacles, the card above the word outcome. That can be about giving or receiving. They feel like they feel like you don't want to give to this anymore. And that with the Page of Pentacles, you have the card below the word outcome. Um, they feel like... The connection is, is, is going sour or it's, they feel like you're losing interest. Yeah, because the Page of Pentacles can be about boredom in some kind of way. Or it can be about something lo losing its luster. So, they feel like you're just not interested in, in them anymore. They could be reaching out to you with some type of message. But like I said, it's showing that you, you're going to start to close yourself off to this. And they can feel your energy. Something has a hold on this person anyways with the devil card here. They're mad. Yeah, things were going too slow. And I'm getting it's because something has a hold on this person. Could be another person or just some type of devil type of energy. Yeah, and for some of you, because we got this page of pentacles here, you could be dealing with someone who's younger than you. When you hear the word page in the tarot, that can indicate a student. It can indicate youth, immaturity, or like I said, someone who's just younger than you. Yeah, but they feel like you, you've lost interest, and they're not happy. Yeah, they feel your energy. You're not giving to this anymore. Yeah, so, Scorpio, that's the reading that I have for you. I hope you enjoyed the reading. I hope it resonate. As you know, general readings, they do not resonate with everyone. Then again... If you like the reading, please comment, subscribe, hit the notification bell. That way you'll be notified when I post my next reading. I will also put a link below of the extended of this reading where I'll go over how you both feel about this situation. What's in the near future for the two of you? How you see yourself, best case scenario, and what will happen between the two of you in the next few weeks. There is also a link below for personal readings if you'd like to try one of those. So Scorpio, thank you so much for watching. I hope all of you are doing well and staying safe during this crazy virus season. Hang in there. It's going to pass and we'll all get through this. So stay strong. Take good care. I hope you come back and join me for the next Scorpio reading just in case this one did not resonate. Maybe the next one will. Also, don't forget to keep in mind the roles of the people can be switched. They can be reversed. I mean, you could be them or they could be you. And if you're not dealing with anyone romantically, the other person could be a friend, a family member, a co-worker, or a situation. So just take the reading for however it resonates. Because once again, these are general readings. They're not personal readings. So Scorpio, I can never say it enough. Thank you so very much for watching. I hope you have a great day. I hope to see you at the next reading. And take care. Next